<laughs> the secret sauce. I like that. Man, you gotta give them the secret sauce. All yeah, right. the secret sauce. I think we there. All right, let's do it. There it is, folks. The secret sauce. Who's ready for the secret sauce this <laughs> week? Ontario secret Hawkins sauce. here, the passive income guru. Let me put my pen down real quick. Hope you hope you let hopefully you guys like my little artwork here. <laughs> I, am, I, I am by no means an artist, folks. I'm just a, <laughs> I'm just a plain old marketer, internet marketer here. That's all I am. But look, right. good morning. If you can hear us loud and clear, please hit that like button, hit that love button, share this video. You're going to want to share it. I guarantee you before you end, before oh, yeah. you end today, we have a special guest on today. Now, this is this has become a good friend of mine as well. Uh, she goes by the name D. Car Lady, and um, right. this is our second. This is our number two. Number two. This is our second case study, folks. And the reason we're doing a second case study is because there's been a huge transformation from the first time that we talked and from now, the present. And we're going to dive into it. We're going to give you the secret sauce today. So sit back, relax. Those of you who are sneaking off to the bathroom right now at work, don't get fired. <laughs> in the, don't get fired in the process. They ain't going to get fired. So don't get fired yet. <laughs> you come back to this video anytime you want to. It's going to be streaming yeah. live 24-7 as long as Facebook uh, deems it so. So D. Carl Lady, welcome back to another case study, sister. How are Thanks you doing? Thanks for having today? me. I appreciate it. I'm doing good, man. Feeling good. Feeling good. Yes, sir. Good. I'm having my breakfast this morning, folks. So hopefully, yeah, you me too. Die. I'm drinking my Gatorade. Me too. <laughs> yeah. So, the, I have the title I have here, D. Carly, D. Carl Lady, is from zero to thousand dollar days, and yep. uh, it's the truth. Is that the? It, it, was I telling the that's truth? The truth. I put it in the title. Yes, that's the truth. That's the truth. Well, what that tell me true. what has happened? Well, you know, actually, first of all, um, for those people, there's going to be some new people <clears throat> tuning in here. Let everybody know a little bit about yourself before we get into okay. it, and and, and okay. tell us about that D car lady as well. What does that stand for? All right. Um, well, I'm a I'm an auto mechanic by trade. You know, I did that over ten years. Um, you know, had a repair shop, did mobile auto repair, all that good stuff in the Carolinas. Mm -hmm. You know. Um, so that's where the name came from, the car lady, you know, so it's, it's legit what, what people actually call me, you know, out here in the environment and everything, you know, cause they know me from, uh, working on vehicles, selling vehicles, you know, anything car related, that's what they know me, you know, for, you know, in the entrepreneurial space. But, you know, when I, I didn't get into the online space until January, you know, so the name stuck, you know, how you, you stuck, I said stuck. Y'all just mute that out. Stuck ain't a word. But <laughs> we, <laughs> stuck. we know what you're talking about. <laughs> right, right. You know, um, but but the name stuck, you know, because it, it kept it categorizes me. You know, so I kept so I kept the name and that's what everybody knows me as, you know, in real life and Facebook. I'm the same person, you know, so I didn't have to fake anything, so it just worked. Wonderful, wonderful. So you you've made a name for yourself up in the Carolinas where you be, you're auto mechanic and you also sell vehicles. And so people know you as the D car lady, you know, that's what that's they, right. okay. Wonderful. Wonderful. That's, that's so, right. That's right. So when did you come online? What, what was your transition to the online space? I transitioned to online in January. Um, I started out in MCA because I was uh, doing a car lot at the time. You know, I was trying to shift away from, actually fixing cars and more doing more into sales because fixing cars is hard on your body you know i mean mm -hmm. you make some money but it's hard money so um yep. i got into mca to kind of like add on to the business i want add on to my my car sales business that was the purpose of me doing it and so when i got in the online space with that you know i quickly realized that there was things that as that i knew about marketing that was incorrect right <laughs> you know you you at that time you think that advertising and marketing is the same thing right you know you think you right. put put an ad on craigslist you marketing i didn't know i found that out when i got an mca why because i did not have results at the beginning you know mm -hmm. what i'm saying so it taught me quickly that look you need to learn 
this business. You need to learn to market. So that's kind of how it, how it started with me failing at the beginning, you know, really bombing, hitting the bottom, you know, um, in my first two weeks with MCA. And then I said, you know what, I have to take it back to the fact that when I started my, my uh, auto repair businesses, I had to start by learning, right? Mm -hmm. I didn't know how to jack up a car. You know, I didn't know how to do breaks, so I had to do what? I had to learn. So I said, well, this is no different. So I had to learn the market, and so I got me some training. You know, I paid for me some training and got some free training in some areas and everything because I had to quickly learn, too, that you're not going to get all the training that you need for free, right? right? There's a difference. You know, so I had I had to realize that, too, because, you know, when you first start, everybody's like, you shouldn't have to pay anyone for training, and da 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 right? I look back now, I'm like, yeah. <laughs> How did that work out for you? Right. So, you know, people still <laughs> struggling, thinking that same thing. And, you know, so yep. that's where I started. And, you know, like I said, once I started learning the market, it was addictive. Right. Mm. It was like a drug. You know how people say love is a drug. Man, marketing is a drug because you start seeing things clearer. You know, I started seeing how I could market for my, my car lot to sell cars and then market, you know, for MCA at the time online you know i'm like oh wow i never knew this i didn't know about a capture page oh my gosh i was supposed to be collecting emails was i now you know i didn't know all this stuff and when you start learning it it's like you just want to dive into it i mean so i i spent a few months just like hard marketing when i say hard training i'm talking about where other people are going to work for eight hours i'm training for eight hours mm -hmm. you know so my my car lot business had to suffer a little bit because sometimes when you're trying to get somewhere you, you're going to suffer in other areas because you got to give that time to get there. But, but your vision that you have is worth it, right? For I sure. know whenever I get into a business, I know that what I'm getting into, I'm going to win. I know that within myself because of who I am, right? And I hope that everybody else knows that. I know I'm going to win. So I said, you know what? I'm going to sacrifice wow. now. You know what I mean? I'm going to sacrifice my time now, sacrifice the other business now because I'm going to be able to make it better. And I'm going to be able to make myself better, right? So that's what I started doing learning on um, marketing training on um, watching different gurus um like i said paying for some training and then things start you know um picking up for me you know i i started linking up with some different people um you know develop the team and help them because that's a big thing too like i was already like that in in my offline world as far as when you learn things that are like powerful that like you saw that you were able to take yourself from here to here and it's not always like oh well i went from no money to a million dollars no it's from I went from, let's say, not having customers in your auto repair business to having customers. When you have any type of transition, you want to share that with the people who are around you. You're like, hey, man, you got a bit. Look, I'm going to tell you what I did in my business. You know, so I'm talking to other people. I, I'm, I'm going to tell you what I did in my business, man. It works. I know it works because it worked for me. Try it, you know, yeah. type situation. So that's what I started doing online. When I started um, learning how to market, I wanted to share that with other people. And what happened was I built up a team because, you know, when you're teaching people something that they – want and need to know, right? Because they might be struggling like you were, then they latch on to you, you know, and you, you right. resonate with them. You talk to them in the inbox, you know, um, um, I, I got in with a uh, Facebook group, you know, so it's me and two other people who are the uh, admins of it, where we wanted to give them the stuff that we had paid for, hmm. right? But we didn't give it to them like the same videos. Now nah, you, that's copyright infringement. You can't do that. We had to learn it first. Mm -hmm. Then we would tell it to them the way that we learned it, you know, because it's like, hey, man, we was there, you know, we were struggling. We don't want y'all to have to struggle like this if it's, if it's because y'all didn't have the information. So we started sharing what we knew. It's still up to them to take action, of course, but we started sharing what we knew and more people, you know, get attracted to you because there's a lot of people who don't share, mm -hmm. you know, they're like, yeah, I'm winning. Yeah. You know, they dangle the money in front of you like, I'm winning. Get you some. <laughs> you know, <laughs> we didn't want to do that. You know what I'm saying? Because we done felt it. You know, we, we felt what it is, the struggle. We felt what it is to have like 30 leads and you can't close one. We mm -hmm. felt that with MCA. You know what I'm saying? So we said, you know what? We paid hundreds of dollars and thousands of dollars for this stuff. But, you know, we're going we're gonna to give back to some people who say they want it and then let them take off from it. Nice. Well, you said some a lot of key key things in uh, what you just said, Dcar, and I want to uh, zoom in on a couple of those things. You said, you said, I know I'm going to win. 
Just think of everybody who starts a business says that I know I'm right. going to win. I hear a lot of the opposite. You know, I don't know if I can do this. You know, I, it's, it's, it looks too far fetched to me. If someone comes into an online space or any business that says, I know I'm going to win, they're going to end up winning because you, your, your product, your, your, you know, your success is only a derivative of what you believe in yourself. It's not, it's not other people that's going to help, it's going to make you win. Right. We that's can true. inspire you, like this live video is probably going to right. inspire you, but we can right. we can literally take you by the hand and say, you know, we're going to help you do this. Uh, you know, you have to take it up on yourself right. to really dig deep and make it happen. So you said, so that was key point right there. Then you said sacrifice. I'm going to sacrifice right now so that I can have the freedom. I can have the freedom in the future. That's another important point. Important point. You got me sacrifice. Sacrifice. Oh, let me see. Jesus. So that's what it's all about. It's it's I'm not muted. I'm tearing. Hold on. Oh, you got can muted. You hear me now? I can hear you. Oh, yeah. Hold on one sec. Yeah, you got muted right there. For some, there you go. You good. You good. Can you hear me good? Dang it. Why I can't hear him? I can't. I can't hear you. you can't hear me? I'm trying to figure out the volume thing because my phone had rang and it, uh. Oh, okay. Okay. Hold on one sec. I can't hear you. I'm trying to get it back on. Let me see. Yeah, you're, you're unmuted. Okay. All right. Yeah, I got it. No, when my phone rang, it kicked my Bluetooth off, and I had to figure uh, out how to get it. Sorry about that. Okay. I'm with you now. All right. Good deal. Good deal. So, um, so basically, that's what I was. I know you caught the first part of that. So, basically, you know, this you know, you, you knew you were going to win, and, right. and a lot of and sacrifice. Yeah. Sacrifice was a big deal for you. It's all about sacrificing to get where you want to be. Yeah, I definitely had to sacrifice. I mean, I've, I've had people, you know, that I, you know, talk to about the opportunity or what have you. And they'll say, oh, you know, well, I'd like to do it, but I don't have the money. <laughs> and I just share my story with them. When I started with Easy One Up, which is the first product, you know, in there, when I started with Easy One Up itself, right? Mm -hmm. um, I started at the thousand dollar level, so it cost me eleven hundred dollars, right? Mm -hmm. Now, if I would have taken that eleven hundred dollars cash wise, and did that, and I'm like, man, you know, rent tomorrow might not get paid. So what I had to do was, is I put it on a credit card because I was betting on myself, right? I said, I said, D, I know you can do whatever you got to do to pay that thousand dollars off before right. the interest hits, right? And I and I and I already know how to work with credit cards as far as counting the cycle, so I can get instead of 25 days, I can get 54 days, right? Mm -hmm. You know. So I counted it on that card. I counted it. I said, if I buy this day, then I'll have 54 days to pay, right? And I said, I'm betting that I can do whatever I need to do to pay that card off before it have interest. And that's what I did. And I, and I just, you know, share that with uh, people, you know, but I mean, everybody's going to have their own thing, have their excuses. You know, not everybody's going to have excuses, but some people are going to have excuses. And I leave it at that because I, I don't get into trying to convince somebody you know, because I'm the type that I'm a helper, but I am not going, I'm not the type to try and convince you from, no, I can't do it to yes, I can. That's not me. That's a big, right? that's, a, that's a huge difference between right. you know, huge helping difference. someone and trying to convince. That's right. Well, I'm not going to convince you. If you calling yourself a loser, I'm not your therapist. But if mm. you're saying, man, I know I can succeed somewhere, but I just don't know where to start. That's where I come in. I said, I got you. Oh. You telling me you don't even know, you know, I, don't, I can't do this, man. I done tried everything. I just can't do it. Okay. Hit me up when you're ready. That's, that's my answer. Like literally. There you go. Powerful D car. Now, and you're right. You know, people have like folks, you have to, you have to get to a point where success is inevitable in your mind first. You, right. You, just like you D car. When someone says, well, I don't know if I can do it. Hey, you know they're they're not they're not worth my time because we know time time is money time is of essence. 
So, and we, you know, the lang people have to talk the language first before we can give them, you know, the chance to talk, you know, to speak with them. Right. And that's, and that's, and that's the honesty that people, that a, a lot of people don't give you that honesty. What you just said, say, hey, mm -hmm. you know, I'm not going to convince you when you're ready, then I can help you. But other than that, you wasted my time. People right. are not going to tell you that. This is what people did to me and they do it to other people. They sugarcoat it. Yeah. Oh, no. You can do it. I made a thousand last week, so you can do it. That they dangle all this stuff, right? They ain't added nobody. They ain't said nothing about how the person can do it, right? And they yeah. just keep on talking, keep on talking until you say, yeah, type situation. Then you get in there, then you be mad because you still ain't learned nothing, right? Yeah. Nah, I'm, you're, not, you're not worth my time. If you're not worth your time, then how you going to think that you're worth my time if you don't even believe in yourself? Mm. Then, then what, am I, what can I do for you if you don't believe in yourself first? You don't... I tell the person, look, you don't have to have made no money. You can be unemployed, right? You can have no legs. I don't care. But if you have the mentality that says, D, I know I need some help. How can you help me? Then we, we, we on it. We on it. It's just a mentality. And that's why when I first started going live, you know, um, even before Easy One, as I was um, doing the marketing training, some things were starting to come clear to me, right? Mm -hmm. So when I first started going live, I wasn't even talking about the opportunity I was in. People only knew I was in MCA because of the groups I was in type of situation, but I didn't talk about the opportunities. I talked about the mindset. You know, I, I talked about that you got to believe in yourself. I talked about that if you have toxic people around you, you know, you got to drop them, leave them, mm -hmm. right? I talked about that type of stuff because I know for a fact 100% because I was an entrepreneur beforehand, so I already know that the mindset is first. You get that down first, then other things will open up because people will actually, you know, actually be willing to help you. But if you out there being a, a glum bug, well, it's me. My sponsor left me. I want to quit. Who knows the number to quit? This type of stuff they was doing in the MCA group. Who knows the number to quit? Just call the number in the back of your car, quit. That's all I got to say to you. That's right. You want to you commit suicide? All right, go ahead, man. But if you're saying, man, I haven't made any sales, I don't know what I'm doing wrong, please help. Mm -hmm. Now I got you. Yeah, we can help them then. Yeah. We can definitely help them. So, and D. Carl, you went from, now tell us about your, your transformation from the time that we did a, did, did, did a case study last time up until now. What has changed since the last time? Which... Not, it wasn't too long ago. No, it wasn't too long ago. What has changed is a further commitment to being consistent in the things that you do. Mm -hmm. You know, and I know we, we all hear about, oh, you got to be consistent, got to be consistent, right? But a lot of times you don't know what that really means. You think that means you just need to post every day, but then you don't know what to post and stuff like that. But mm -hmm. what has happened is I've been doing more training, right? Because an easy one up, I got $1,000 worth of training, right? And then I got connected you know, with our mastermind group that we have and got connected. So now I'm being able to see how things are put into place. And I just started taking action. I'm serious. That's literally what I did. I started taking action. Oh. I started working on creating products that can help other people. Right. I, I started thinking about the actions that I was doing, not just putting out posts, but think about it. What what is my what is my end game for this post? Am I just putting it out there? Say, hey, join me. What, what are you going to do? You know, mm -hmm. with that know um are you teaching anybody anything you know i started looking looking at those type of things and started tailoring what i did to those things and learning the different strategies that you you teach in that group as well and started implementing those and being more consistent you know because sometimes you can get discouraged when you're doing things and you don't see a result right right but once you do something what someone told you to do the steps that you're supposed to take and then you, you see some type of result, something, some opt-ins or something. You're like, okay, it can work. I just got to do it more consistently. So I started being more consistent with it. Okay, boom, let me do this. And then, you know, you talk about having more fishing poles in the water. So I'm like, okay, well, that's, you know, I've heard it before, but it didn't really sink in. I'm like, well, since he said it and he's been right so far and everything and I'm here, all right, well, let me try it, you know? So you put a fishing pole here, put a fishing pole there, you know, I started taking time with those fishing expeditions. 
right? Mm -hmm. That's another thing. I started taking time with this. Sometimes we want to put up a quick post and I understand it happens, you know, but at some time you also got to put in the time to do some stuff too. You know, I started taking, it might take me like a week to complete, complete a funnel. That funnel that I completed that um, wound up landing me that uh, $1,500 weekend that I had last weekend, mm. it took a week to complete that funnel, right? But it took like another half a week to come up with the idea and put it into fruition, you know, like see it and then complete the funnel. And it's not like, oh, you don't know how to complete funnels. No, because I had to put some thought into it, you know? And when I deployed my strategy for that, which always has value on the front, right? Then boom, some dollars came out the back. So it's about doing consistent work, but doing consistent smart work. I started doing that. And that that is what has been the change from, you know, you know, getting a lot of opt-ins, a lot of science and everything quick. And I mean, that's, man, that, that's, that's the start right there, you know, and right. then doing stuff more consistent and more precise, you know, and it's like, oh, wow, you know, and I mean, just doing the little things that you didn't know about, you know, like you showed us a couple of things that maybe if I had been doing them things in MCA, maybe I would have, you know, maybe it wouldn't have been so difficult, but I didn't know those things. Why? Because I was stuck in the mindset that I ain't got to pay nobody. I ain't, I ain't going to join nothing. You know, well, you keep doing that and keep losing, right? So mm -hmm. I started being consistent, putting those things in place, doing the things. And I'm talking about a lot of this stuff was free, but you just had to do it. Right. And I'm wow, goodness, you wake up to, oh, you got, uh, you know, uh, five, no, it's seven. Yes, yeah, seven affiliate sales here. Like, oh, wow, that's just on the back end, you know, because we got the residual income. That's on the back end. Yeah. Then, you know, before I got up good today, I get an email. You know, I hadn't sent anyone my presentation and, and gave them no spiel or nothing. And I'm like, hundred dollars? Where this hundred dollars came from? You know? And then I get a, a, you know, and I deploy one of the strategies, get hundred dollars, and then a text message like, oh yeah, I get paid on Friday, and I want to sign up. I'm really interested. So Off of a sixty second strategy. So a six okay. So you're popping sales left and right, and I'm seeing it because you're posting in in the group. I'm right. seeing, I was like, D car. I mean, I'm getting notifications from D car every, every, every day. D car, D car. I said, what is she doing over here? And, and I mean, uh, I, you know, you and just, I, got to the point where I don't even want to post it on my wall. Cause I had posted some stuff on my wall, but right. it's like, some of this stuff comes out, man. It's like, I'm a humble person. So mm -hmm. I don't want a person to take it as, Oh, I'm bragging this, that, and the third. So I'll post it in our group. I'm like, man, y'all look, I just got to tell you this is true. I ain't even posted on my public wall, but. I just got to tell y'all, this is right here. This is what it is. You know, because I want you guys to know, but I don't want it to always post everything on my public wall because on one hand, yeah, it attracts people to you, but on the other hand, you don't want people to think you bragging or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm not a bragger. If I was a bragger, I wouldn't care, but I'm not. You know what I mean? But I definitely have to tell y'all because it's like, man, look, because we got a lot of newbies in there. It's like, look, man, it works. This is what I did. Boom, 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 boom. You know? And you know what? Nothing wrong with posting on your wall. Social proof is one of the most powerful marketing strategies out. Cause because here, here's why. Because people are there's a lot of skepticism online. Lots of skepticism. And if they can find a real person like like you and, and I and other other marketers out there who they're showing proof. They're 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 showing that hey, they're they're real people. They have a family. They 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 they're real. They're authentic. People love that, and, and you'll be amazed. The gravitational pull towards you is more is stronger. So nothing wrong with sharing on your wall. I do it all the time. It's it's, right it's great <laughs> social. Media. That's all. Like man, man Terry is killing it all, man. And look, and, but the thing is, for me, when I see people show proof, it motivates me. You know, that's what it does for me. Yeah. Every time I see yeah. you post something or in our group, Kyrie post up something, you know. Um, Torres post up something, everybody post up something. And I mean, it might be $25. It might be opt-ins. We right. all like, man, man, man. I mean, we, we acting like it's us, you know what I'm saying? But it motivates you. It's like, oh my gosh, you know, like Kyrie messaged me, um, yesterday, right? Kyrie messaged me the other day and showed me a screenshot, you know, of something that she did and, and she got, you know, a sale. So I'm just laying down. I'm like, man, let me go ahead and get up and start doing it. What you did, Kyrie? Oh, okay. You know, and it yeah. motivates you ahead and do it because it's like you see your teammate doing it oh, and man. it's not to have oh. millions of followers either it's like oh shoot let me do it let me do it you know and today i got you know i, I wake up two hundred dollars it's like yeah 
you know, so everybody's winning. So it just, it makes me feel good to see other people win. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, not everybody's like that. They don't like to see other people win. Me, I legit get just as happy for other people winning, you know, that I do for myself because it lets me know, it continues to let me know it's possible. It renews, you know, your faith that it can work. Just keep on working it. It can work. It can work. When you get results, like, yeah, it definitely can work. It definitely can work. You know, and you just keep doing it. That's right. That's right. Hey, you know, and I'm like, I'm like yourself. I love to see other people winning. You know, I when I get results, you know, I'm like, oh, okay, yeah, I've seen that before. But when I when I see other people, I yeah. I get really excited, really inspired from yeah. other people getting results. That's what keeps me going because if I can show somebody one little strategy, and D Carl, we had a great training in our group yesterday. Oh, yeah. We, oh, we, man. What, what was the man, just just throw out <laughs> one secret sauce that that was in the train because we do folks if you don't know yet i am a stickler of helping other people win okay that's why you see d car here she's 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 a product of of some of the strategies that we are showing in the group so every single monday in, in my facebook group we do a Q&A style training. Yesterday was almost two hours long, an hour and 45 minutes. Yeah. Hey, Carl, you used a strategy. You said a 60-second strategy today yeah. to pop the commission second. for you. The one yeah. that you, uh, you had actually taught us before. Mm-hmm. And, you know, sometimes you can get complacent. I hadn't done it, right? I'm like, you know, so I'm laying down. Like I said, all oh, this is before I got up. I said, man, let me go ahead and do this. So, you know, you had told us to send out an email right? Mm -hmm. An email offering people a bonus, you know? So, and you told, and the thing is, it's not like how other trainings, they tell you to do something, but they don't tell you how to do it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So you said, look, this is the exact email I sent out. Twerk it for you, put your details, but use this. So I took the exact email, twerked it for me, use this, right? And I sent it out, you know, to the people you said, send it out to, I sent it out. Mm -hmm. And then, then, you know, so I'm, I'm going about, you know, strategizing what I'm going to do for the day. And I get an email. $100. Mm. And I get a text message. I want to sign up Friday. I saw your email. Absolutely. Right. That's amazing. Like, it's amazing. Amazing. <laughs> when I message you, right, I'm like, like, people who, like, know me on the inbox know I'm, like, so animated when I, I when <laughs> anything happens. It could be a penny. I don't even care. You know, so I'm like, who can I call? Oh my gosh, who can I call? Look at this, Anybody, who, who can I call? You know, so I reached out to you and I'm telling you, blah, 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 man, look, look, because I had just messaged you about the tech strategy. And then I reached out to uh, Tasha, but she hadn't answered yet. You know what I mean? So I just like, I have to tell somebody like, look, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, look, 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 and I didn't do nothing. You know what I mean? So I mean, the stuff. The That's stuff, what it is. Stuff. That's what you use stuff. right now. The yeah, the sauce. secret sauce. <laughs> the secret sauce. And I mean, the thing I'll say about it that's different from the stuff that we talk in our group, from the stuff that I've, I've been taught as far as when they say they give you the secret sauce, they will tell you what to do, but they don't tell you how to do it so you still be lost. They right. won't really give you the secret sauce. They won't say, hey, this is the exact thing I did, mark it to you. They will say, well, you know, just create something. And you out there trying to create something from scratch, but you don't know what you don't know. So you, you still struggle and you're like, well, I don't know. It doesn't work for me. No, it's because they left stuff out. Just be honest. They left stuff out, mm-hmm. you know, but when we do our trainings, you, you, you show us what's what, I mean, you know, I've asked you plenty of times, I'm saying, what you using? Can I get that share code? Sure, sister. That's what you say. <laughs> I'll put it up in the group. You know, <laughs> we laugh yeah. about that sometimes. He says, sure, sister. I'll put it up in the group. Everybody can get it. You know, and that's a yep. big plus. So, and that's a big plus and a big plus for all of our success in there because if we ask for something like that to that's going to help us you know you, you're not like nah you can't get that you know what I mean? <laughs> you're like fine here it is you know i'm like cool that's what's up and then all we have to do is actually do it and we actually see results not like years from now we see results you know quickly compared to other stuff we didn't see any results that's right well i tell you what you know, I'm a big, I'm a believer. You know, I believe believe in the in the word of God. And you know what it says? It's in Acts, in the book of Acts. It's better to give than receive. And you know what, folks? I've experienced that 
a hundredfold. I, I, I experience it every single day. I would rather give something to you that's good than receive it for myself. If I can do that, I'm helping, I'm helping you out. I'm serving you. So it's all about when it comes to the online game, it's not a, really a game. It's all about serving. Right. Other people. That, and that's other true. People get where they want to get. You know, Jim Rohn talked about that. Help others get where they want to get. You're going to get what you what you want to get. It, it, right. It's it's the law. It go. It doesn't go away. That's it is universal. True. It works. You so know. you know my second my second message after I hit you and Tasha up, then I hit up Janae because you know I just signed up. Um, Janae, she's one of the signs in the in the weekend. I said, mm -hmm. Janae, do you have a strategy that you're going to use after you get all of your, your opt-ins and everything if you run traffic? I said, if you got one you're going to use, great, wonderful. I said, if you don't, hit me up because I got one for you. So now I'm going to, even though it's in the training, but she came on only this weekend, I'm going to tell mm -hmm. her to do the exact same thing. There this you is go. What you, do what I did, Janae. Do what I did, right? You know, because you don't just sign a person up and then you leave them. When something works for you, you say, hey, this worked for me. There's nothing special about me. That means mm -hmm. like, oh, it only worked for D. No, it worked for me. It worked for Kyrie. It worked for and these just people I know in the group. It worked for um Antonio, um, um Ontario. It's gonna work for you too. Look, yeah. Do this. This is what I did. Do this. It's gotta you be know, based. And give me the right strategy. That's right. And you help them out. That's you right. know, that's another thing I like about the group. Um, is that you know people are not afraid to help the next one out. Like even in the mm -hmm. inbox, like me and Kyrie, we talk in the inbox a lot. And then another lady just signed up. Um, I forgot her name, Lacise or something like that. But she signed up with Kyrie, but Kyrie turned on to me like, hey, you know, D is real helpful. So she hit me up. So she was asking me a couple of questions in the inbox about what she got going on in her campaign and everything. I said, okay, yeah, you do this right here. You know, so it's like people are willing to help in that group, whereas other stuff that people get into, they're not willing to help unless you directly signed up with them. They're like, nah, I don't want to right. help. But in that group, it's like, if somebody's like, oh, yeah, I did this, they're like, oh, how'd you do it? This is what I did. They posted in there. Or they hit you in the inbox, you know, if y'all talking in the inbox. You know, mm -hmm. hey, yeah, oh, look at these options I got. Look at this cell I got, whatever, blah, blah, blah. And they'd be like, oh, how you do it here? They ain't doing it to brag. They're like, here, they give you the whole script. This is exactly what I use. Right. This is the exact post I use. This is exactly what I said, you know. So that is, it's like the whole environment is just, it's, it's, it's what makes it work. It's part of the sauce. So a person yes. can take the opportunity, right? And let's say they. Uh oh, D. Carr can. They're not in our group. I'm not saying the other groups are bad, but let's say they're not in our group. They're in another. Okay, are you there? A call came in, threw me off. You there? Oh, yeah, I'm here. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we got you now. I was saying in our group, we helpful. So, like, let's say a person joined like the opportunity, but they're with another team or something or another group because we all sign under different people and that, that group is not helpful. Then they may not see the same type of results we see because it's a whole thing. It ain't just the opportunity. It's about how it's put together in that funnel for one, right? Cause I had the opportunity before I had that funnel, but I've never had the success that I've had with the opportunity until I got that funnel. And then it's the group environment that we're in training and not um, scared to help each other. So I can't right. say what they can achieve out there, but in our group, it's the whole thing, whole package. So I know they're going to be able to achieve all the success that they're willing to work for. That's right. That's right. And, uh, very, you know, good key points there. It's all about implementation, plugging in and, and staying consistent. That's the secret sauce, folks. It's nothing, it's nothing new that we have invented. There's nothing new under the sun. We're just taking stuff that we've learned and implementing it and then just passing on the knowledge you see that's all that's all we're doing and the secret like i said the secret sauce of why d has been able to go from zero to thousand dollar plus days pretty much overnight is because she first of all made a sacrifice that she was going to make it happen and she said to herself I am going to win no matter what. Just think, if you woke up every single day, you said it to yourself, I'm winning today. I don't care what obstacles come in my way. Just think about that, if you woke up like that. So here's what we're going to do, folks. We are going to invite you to our environment, OK? Let me do something real quick, D. Carr. I'm going to share my screen. All right, cool. Let me let me uh, share my screen and show these show these folks. All right. 
what we have. Okay, pretty sure they can see my screen. Can you see my screen there, D-Car? Yep, I see it. All right. So, folks, we're giving you a free invitation to the group. The group name is called Passive Income Superstars. All right. We're like a big family here. We take care of each other. And every single week in this group, and we invite every, we, we invite a ton of people every day, new people. Yep. Every single week in this group, you're going to get trained. Okay. Now, this training yesterday, 23 hours, about a day ago, uh, this training, an hour and 42 minutes long, is going to really give you a lot of value. Okay. D Carr yep. used a strategy, just one strategy from this training yesterday, and she made and she's popping sales in her sleep. Okay. Let me just show you some of the comments here so you can see that this is the real deal. All right. Get this here. All right, Katrina, I read this the other day. Katrina said, you absolutely rock on Terry. You really give some great, valuable training. This was exactly what I was looking for. So glad I'm in, in your group. All right, got a lot of comments. Great nuggets. Thank you. Thanks a million. All right, so guys, this, I mean, D car, you got not only how to how to send an email, sixty second email, but you got some other things. That, oh yes, yeah, there uh, was some other stuff in there that I didn't think lot, about. A lot of stuff. So we do this every single Monday, folks. When you get in our group, you get this training. Okay. Now, when you decide to join, you just come to Passive Income Superstars. Answer the three questions. That's very important. I'm going to show you guys something that's going to blow you away. We'll go to Funnel X Group. I saw this yesterday, D. Carl. Probably you saw this too. We got new members who's coming into Funnel X RI, folks. Shelly Swansea. Okay. She is a new, she's never, from what I understand, she's never did anything like this before. Never. Okay. Never. And she made $100 yesterday, folks. She's not all plastered on YouTube. She's not all plastered on Facebook like that. She she took a part of our co-op. Car, did you know we had a co-op? Oh, yeah, yeah. I remember that post. She did the co-op and made a $100 sale. Yep. Yeah. So we have a, we. I mean, guys, when we say we have all everything you need to be successful with this system, we have everything. New people getting 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 paid. Let me show you yep. this. That's Kyrie right there. Kyrie. She's yeah, that's Kyrie. <laughs> amazing. Amazing. Yep. She's not too long ago, and she's popping $500 and $250 payments. She's my yep. next case study, by the way, D-Car. Oh, yeah. She's a good one, man. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> You're on fire. I'm serious. Now, I want to leave you. I'm going to leave you guys with this. This lady right here blows my mind. Lori Bennett. She's not plastered on YouTube either. She doesn't, you know, people come to me all the time and say, the reason you're getting sales on Terry is because you have a big following. You have a big list. Let me, let me zone you in on something real quick, okay? This lady right here, brand new, never did anything like this on the internet, doesn't have a big following, doesn't have a huge list. Now, here is the icing on the cake. She's legally blind. Yep, yep. I saw that one too. Exactly. So people yesterday, have no excuse. That's amazing. Yesterday she made $525 in commissions. Blind, folks. Now, if yep. that doesn't inspire and motivate you to, to get up I, and do something, I don't know what I, will. I don't know what will. I mean, <laughs> ain't nothing else I can say. I don't know what will. Okay? Yeah. That's powerful. When I saw that, I, 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 had, to, I had to freeze for a second, D-Car. And yeah. I was like, this can't be real. This right, can't be right. real. She's making money. What? So, yep. you know, you and I and other people who desire to have a home business, there is absolutely no excuse. I don't have yep. a big list. That doesn't matter. I don't have a huge following. Doesn't matter. It's matter. all in your mind. I'm pretty sure Lori has a mindset that she was going to win, just like you, yep. D. Yep. I'm pretty sure she said, I'm going to make this work regardless of my situation. Regardless of my situation, I'm going to make it work. I don't care. It's going to work. And, and lo and behold, folks, she's making it happen. And what is she doing special? She's tapping into the system and she's yep. tapping into uh, our traffic co-op. I know exactly what she's doing. She's tapping into our traffic co-op and she's making it happen, folks. So my question to you, if you're watching this, 
right now. My question to you is, what is your excuse? Right. What, what is, is your excuse? Because there are, for those who want to be successful, there are no excuses. And I'm going to take it a little bit further. There is no competition. The only competition is when you go in the restroom and you look in that thing that's looking back at you. What is that? That's right. yourself. That's your image. That's your only that competition is your is yourself. Yep. Absolutely. Absolutely. So, D. Carr, I appreciate you, sister. Keep building, keep growing, keep serving, keep no multiplying. And I'm excited about what what you know what's going to come in the next you know month or so from you, sister. You're 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 gaining. You have a lot of momentum right now. Uh, and that's yeah, your income yeah. stream, boy. Oh, <laughs> oh man, that's all I can say, Terry. Look, look, I'm gonna tell y'all, y'all get in that group, y'all get plugged in, man, and y'all put in the work, y'all gonna become financially free, man. I look, I'm, yeah. I'm on my way there. I see it. Yeah. You see it. I, now I, you I see, you that. see I said, now. I said, man, Terry ain't gonna make me financially free watching him. Watch this. <laughs> the secret so. <laughs> <laughs> that's it, folks. So here's the deal. If you're looking at this video, I'm pretty sure it's going to go viral. It's going to be on YouTube. It's going to be, you know, you may have it in your email box or your text message, whatever it is. Get back to the person that, that invited you or just sent that, yeah. this information to you. Get back to them ASAP. Get right. started. Get plugged in and don't look back. Don't say, oh, I don't know if I can do it. Say, say something like this. I'm going to start and I'm going to win regardless of what happens, regardless of the obstacles, regardless of what I think I fear, I'm going to make it happen. If you do that, I can guarantee, folks, you yep. will win. You will win. It is yep. absolutely inevitable. Absolutely inevitable. Okay? Yep. So I'm gonna, uh, when I'm doing D-Car, I'm going to see who's tuned in real quick. We may have somebody that has some questions. I doubt it. But we'll All see. Right. We'll see. I'm going to, so it's best to look at it on my cell phone because I can see all the comments. Yeah, you can see all of them, yeah. All right. All right, I think we're good. All right, folks, go ahead and get back to the person that invited you. And d -Card, thanks again for tuning in, sister. I really appreciate you. Not a problem, and, okay, uh, I appreciate you. Looking forward to your increase. Sound like a plan, y'all have a blessing. All right, take care now.